to get the free notes of electrical circuits check the link in the comment section and install the app for free thevenin's theorem question find current through eight ohm resistance here in this circuit we have to find the current through this eight ohm resistance by using thevenin's theorem solution first of all we will see what is thevenin's theorem thevenin's theorem states that a linear two terminal circuit can be replaced by an equivalent circuit consisting of a voltage source vth in series with a resistor rth where this vth is the open circuit voltage at the terminals and this rth is the equivalent resistance at the terminals when all the independent sources are turned off and this is the load resistor rl this is load resistor rl and this is current il load current il now we can easily find the value of il il is equal to vth divided by rth plus rl rth plus rl and this circuit is called as thevenin's equivalent circuit thevenin's equivalent circuit now first of all we will find the value of rth so to find rth turn off all independent sources turn off all independent sources now here we can see in this circuit we have to find the value of rth so first step is to turn off all the independent sources now when we turn off this voltage source that time it will be short circuited also we have to remove here we can write and remove remove rl so this is the load resistor rl we have to remove this from here and now this will be our rth that is thevenin's resistance so here we can write rth is equal to here we can see this 6 ohm and 10 ohm are connected in parallel so it will be 6 ohm parallel with 10 ohm now when we solve this so it will be 6 into 10 divided by 6 plus 10 Six into ten divided by six plus ten. So it is three point seven five. Three point seven five is the value of RTH. Since it is resistance, so its unit will be ohm. Now next we have to find the value of VTH. so to find vth to find vth first of all remove remove rl and voc that is open circuit voltage is equal to vth let's copy this circuit once more time now here we have to remove this rl and now this will be the open circuit voltage or we can directly write this will be our vth this will be positive here and negative here so here we have to find this voltage first of all we will apply kvl to the outer loop let's say this current is current i let's say this is a loop with current i so we will apply kvl to outer loop apply kvl to outer loop 
now let's say according to the direction of this current this will be positive here negative here positive negative let's say we are starting from this point so it will be minus 20 then plus 6 i plus 6 i then plus 20 i plus 10 i plus 10 i then plus 12 plus 12 is equal to 0 here the loop is completed so the algebraic sum of all the voltages in a loop is equal to 0 this is called as kvl that is kirchhoff's voltage law now we can find the value of current i from this equation so it will be this minus 20 and this plus 12 this will be minus 8 and this will be plus 16 i is equal to 0 so 16 i is equal to 8 so i is equal to 8 by 16 it is equal to 1 by 2 or we can write it is 0 0.5 ampere now we got the value of current i again we will copy this circuit from here and the value of i is 0 0.5 now we will apply kvl to inner loop let's say this current is current i1 so here we can write apply kvl to inner loop apply kvl to inner loop now let's say we are starting from this point so it will be minus 20 then plus 6 i1 plus 6 i1 then plus vth plus vth is equal to 0 now here we can see this current i is equal to i1 so here we can write i is equal to i1 is equal to 0 0.5 ampere ampere here so here we can write minus 20 plus 6 in place of i1 we will write 0 0.5 then plus vth is equal to 0 so therefore vth is equal to this will be minus 20 then plus 6 into 0 0.5 so it is minus 17 if it goes on right side so it will be plus 17 volt so this is the value of vth now we got the value of vth that is thevenin's voltage and thevenin's resistance rth so we can draw thevenin's equivalent circuit so let's copy this circuit from here and now let's paste it here now substitute the value of vth it is 17 volt and the value of rth is 3.75 ohm so it is 3.75 ohm the value of rl here we can see in this question we have to find the current through 8 ohm resistance that means this is our rl so here we can write rl is equal to 8 ohm or we can write it here here rl is equal to 8 ohm so rl is equal to 8 ohm now we have to find this il the value of vth is 17 the value of rth is 3.75 plus the value of rl is 8 so this will be 17 divided by 3.75 plus 8 so it is 1.446 1.446 and since it is current so its unit will be ampere so therefore i 8 ohm is equal to i l is equal to 1.446 ampere so this is how we can find the value of current by using thevenin's theorem check the link in the comment section and install the app for free to get the notes of electrical circuits thanks for watching